What's going on, guys? This is Charlie Chinchilla from the Society Badger. Once again, um, I just got this game. I've not played it yet at all. I've played two. I've beaten it three or four times. This is Postal 3. This game is definitely probably going to be one of the craziest things I've ever played. So, uh, let's get this started. It's probably going to be a little bit for loading, but... This game, I've seen a lot of trailers for it, and there's actually a weapon in this game that is a badger that has a handle that tears people apart. <laughs> so yeah, what's this say? After completing the art for the game, RWS lead artist Josie went to weeks of rampage over turning cars and making demands for s for the severed head of Justin Bieber. <laughs> I'm here with a man known only as the Postal Dude. Yeah, I hate that fucking name. Uh, okay, do you have a real name? Uh, I forget. Kids, don't do drugs. <laughs> Too much green health herb. Or meth. <laughs> Just kidding, kids. Do as I say, not as I do. Okay. So, I've read that you were in paradise before it was completely devastated by the unsolved nuclear incident. Yeah, due to an unfortunate uh, subprime mortgage malfunction, I was forced to relocate to a much nicer neighborhood with my beautiful wife. I'd just been hired by one of America's premier video game companies. Management decided that I was overworked and needed a sabbatical. Nothing personal, man, but you're fired. I used the time to check some errands off my list. Got Gary Coleman's autograph, that was pretty sweet. Picked up some steaks, played with elephants, went to confession, and visited my dad's grave. Cause that's how I roll. Speaking of religion, weren't you at the Church of Dave compound during the massacre? Yeah, it was my Uncle Dave's birthday. I got him one of those bad touch crotchy figures. Those things were harder to get than strangle bait Elmo. Awesome park day at Dave's until the man showed up. I'm pretty sure they had the wrong address. Anyway, it wasn't really a religious cult. It's more like a cheap scam for Dave to hook up with Christian chicks. Apparently they go nuts for the whole, I am the reincarnation of Jehovah, kneel down and watch me play a wicked guitar solo thing. I was impressed. Anyway, after my uh, unfortunate firearms accident, my beautiful wife left me. I was devastated. By then, the neighborhood was lousy with sewer Taliban, and the mad cow Tourette zombie epidemic broke out. So me and Champ decided it was time to get out of town. Besides, about 20 other games were set in cities called Paradise by now. Right. So you were at the Paradise Municipal Bridge when the tragedy struck. I'm not a zombie, damn it. Fuck. was a really cheap shot. Hope you learned a lot about the fucking health system, Skippy. Fuck this shit! Over the car blocking your way. 
stay out of harm's way and help with the general automatically. Say, that's a perfectly good box of grenades. I'd hate to see them go to waste. Well, let's see. That this is taking place after the expansion for Postal 2. Here comes the game, which is the first weekend. Which was the zombie outbreak. Hazardous acid. Alright. Use grenades to destroy approaching zombies. Hold fire to aim, then press the alt fire to throw. If you press alt fire without aiming, dude will plant grenade as a landmine. Hmm. Those guys look scared and cold down there. Would it be wrong of me to want to warm them up? <laughs> oh yeah, gasoline. Nice. Whole fire to pour gasoline and all fire to throw match and ignite it. Okay. Mom always said not to play with fire, but I hate my mom. Mm-hmm. <gasps> 